Piedraya Horti, Wikipedia article audio. Piedraya Horti is a superficial fungus that exists in the soils of tropical and subtropical environments and affects both sexes of all ages. The fungus grows very slowly, forming dark hyphae, which contain chlamydoconidia cells and black colonies when grown on agar. Piedraya horti is a dermatophyte and causes a superficial fungal infection known as black pedra, which causes the formation of black nodules on the hair shaft and leads to progressive weakening of the hair. The infection usually infects hairs on the scalp and beard, but other varieties tend to grow on pubic hairs. The infection is usually treated with cutting or shaving of the hair and followed by the application of antifungal and topical agents. The fungus is used for cosmetic purposes to darken hair in some societies as a symbol of attractiveness. Morphology When grown on agar at 25 degrees Celsius Piedraya horti grows very slowly to form black-greenish, limited, and pointed colonies. Piedraya horti taken from infected hairs have dark brown nodules, which are made up of ascostroma. The nodules have a gritty feel, organized in a stromatic fashion and have a high concentration of chitin and melanoid pigments. The colonies produce a red pigment and remain smooth and covered with short aerial hyphae. Microscopically, P. horti produces short, dark hyphae containing thick walled resting cells. The ascomata consist of irregularly shaped pseudothesia that are black in color. Each ascoma contains a single ascus containing eight ascospores. The ascospores are dark, curved and become very narrow at the ends forming whip-like appendages. Affected hairs develop stone-like black nodules affixed to the hair shaft that cause weakness of the hair. Infected hairs treated with potassium hydroxide fluoresce under ultraviolet light despite that the fungus itself does not normally fluoresce. Fluorescence of the pedra indicates secondary contamination by bacteria. Identification is easily achieved by microscopic examination of the hair nodules, and can be confirmed by sequence analysis of the nuclear ribosomal internal transcribed spacer region. Piedraya horti causes the formation of nodules on the hair shaft, a clinical superficial disease commonly known as black pedra. Black pedra is usually seen in tropical regions and it usually targets humans of all ages and targets the scalp, mustache, and occasionally pubic hair. The source of the infection is usually in soils, poor hygiene, long hair, cultural use of veils and the application of plant oils to wet hair favors the growth of the infection. Black pedra is a superficial fungal infection which means that it is restricted to the stratum corneum and causes no inflammation. The infection of the hair shaft results in the formation of nodules on the scalp, mustache, and pubic hair. The nodules are hard and gritty, which produce a metallic sound when the hair is combed. The nodules colonize the hair shaft, which causes progressive weakness of the hair and leads to breakage of the hair in severe cases which can lead to hair loss and baldness. The fungus also has the potential to destroy the cuticular layers of the hair and move into the cortex. Piedraya horti survives in the scalp is due to the slow rate of the keratin degradation near the cortex and the compact formation of the nodules and the hyphae are tightly packed in black pedra cases. The initial invasion of human hair by P. horti is achieved by using an eroding hyphae, which force their way beneath or between the cuticular layer. The force applied between or beneath the hair cuticle arises from the growth of the fungus itself. The breakdown of keratin is mainly due to enzymatic processes and corresponds to the abundance of localized mitochondria. The breakdown of keratin begins with the cementing material and progresses to the cortex of the hair shaft. 
In the cortex two types of degradative patterns are produced which are either parallel or vertical to the axis hair shaft. The parallel pattern arises from hyphal separation of the external cortical layers. The vertical pattern is produced by direct hyphal penetration which creates channels that increase in size as the cortex degrades. Pathology The infection cannot easily be removed mechanically, although further proliferation of infection can be achieved by avoidance of moisture. Removal generally involves cutting or shaving of the hair, but chemical treatments may be similarly useful. For women some individuals use a fine comb to remove as much of the infection as possible and then they cut or shave their hair. This is then followed by the application of a sublimate solution in 60% alcohol solution to the scalp. Historical treatments have used alcoholic tinctures of heavy metals, such as mercury bichloride. The application of antifungal shampoos such as pyrithian zinc, formaldehyde, and salicylic acid is effective against black pedra. Oral therapy with itraconazole or terbinafine also causes nodules to break down over time. Removal of affected hair and treatment with topical agents is also effective and results in very low recurrences rates. However, even in the absence of treatment, spontaneous remission may occur. Treatment Black pedra is sometimes cultivated for cosmetic purposes due to social factors that favor a specific hair color, which makes them more attractive in their society. Several Indian tribes located from Panama have been known to use several methods in order to darken the hair of albino individuals within their community. One of these methods is the cultivation of black pedra for an extensive period of time in the individual's hair. In Malaysia the nodules of black pedra are very attractive and women are encouraged to sleep with their hair buried in the soil to encourage growth of the black nodules. Cosmetic Uses The genus Pydraya contains another species known as Pydraya quintanile, which is more common in chimpanzees than humans. It differs from P. horti in terms of the ascospores do not have any attachments. Another species known as Trichosporon bijalii is commonly known to cause white pedra. White pedra is more common in temperate and semi-tropical climates, such as South America, Asia, Europe, Japan, and parts of the southern United States. Black pedra usually affects scalp hair, whereas white pedra is more commonly found in pubic hair, axillary hair, beards, mustaches, and eyelashes. White pedra affects horses and monkeys, in addition to humans and the nodules are white and brown in color and can be easily detached from the hair shaft. White pedra is treated by using topical and antifungal agents but a more effective approach is to use a triconazole therapy. Recent studies have shown that the black, lichen colonizing fungus, Xanthoria officii, is closely related to P. horti. Similar taxa